Hello, and welcome to The Point from Navitend. In this screencast, we'll look at using basic Excel formulas for budgeting. Organizing your income can help you better manage your funds and stay on budget. This issue of The Point shows how to use a basic Excel formula to do so. Let's get started. First, open Excel to a blank workbook and enter headings with percentages that apply to your budget, similar to the ones pictured here. Next, enter the formulas that will automatically divide your funds into their respective categories. In this case, we'll start with savings. We want 45% of our income to go into savings, so we type the formula equals B2 asterisk 45%. The B2 portion of the formula refers to the column and row of the income cell that we will be taking 45% of. Because there is no entered income amount, the savings cell displays a zero. However, clicking on it shows that the formula is in fact entered into the cell. Finish entering the formulas for the first row, changing the percentages in the formulas as necessary. So for giving, the formula is equals B2 asterisk 15%. For spending, it's equals B2 asterisk 30%. And for emergency, it's equals B2 asterisk 10%. The next thing to do is to apply the formulas to their entire columns. As you can see, there is a little black square on the lower right-hand corner of the selected cell. Hold your mouse over this little black square until a black cross appears, and then click and drag the rectangle down to encompass as many rows as you need. Repeat with each column. Now each cell contains the correct formula for its column. Before you enter income amounts, each column should be a line of zeros, as shown. Now you're ready to enter your income amounts. I'll enter a few samples. As you can see, the formulas are already at work, distributing the income based on the percentages we specified. With that, we reach the conclusion of the screencast. You can watch previous issues or subscribe to receive the point via email on our website. The link is below. Have a great week.